Hi, Mark Gordon with GoldenTicker.com on Friday morning, June the 22nd, 2012, with a stock market update. The markets uh, confirmed a rally uh, back here last Friday, and then uh, we had, what, one, two, three, four, five uh, up days uh, in a row on this little run here. Uh, closed above this 50-day moving average, this blue solid line, for a couple of days, and then yesterday had a massive uh, a drop, over 2% drop here. Um, uh, back uh, into uh, uh, below the uh, close of, the, of that breakout day and uh, did get support down here at this red line which is the 21 day moving average and near the 10 day moving average however uh, we had a distribution day and that is uh, when the markets fall substantially on rising volume and a distribution day shortly after a confirmed rally <clears throat> this one happened four days after the confirmed rally <clears throat> is not a great sign historically um, that has caused to a lot of rally failures uh, today we're getting a little bit of an update uh, about six tenths of a percent up so far it's about 930 in the morning here on the east on the west coast um, <clears throat> so a little bit of a bump here uh, don't know the volume figures quite yet but uh, distribution yesterday uh, markets uh, are now uh, uh, this confirmed rally is now under pressure um, so you know, I would advise uh, basically just purchase some stocks to, uh, to uh, number one, not purchase any more for now and to uh, cut losses short on any weak acting stocks that you may have picked up. Um, that's just my personal uh, opinion on that. But uh, uh, not looking good for this nascent rally. Now going to a weekly chart of the NASDAQ composite, um, <clears throat> we're actually up a little bit, uh, pretty, actually pretty flat, uh, three one hundredths of a percent up for the week. We notice on the weekly chart some tight closes in here, which is actually a bullish sign. It's showing some uh, kind of support coming in uh, <clears throat> from large investors trying to keep prices stable here right above this gray line, which is the 30-week uh, moving average, 30-week moving average now offering some support. Um, <clears throat> of course, uh, uh, down here is the 40-week moving average, uh, which was breached here a few weeks ago, rallied up from there, got above this blue saw line, which is the 10-week moving average uh, this week, and now closing under it. Uh, so uh, we can see a, a bit of a, a cup formation here, sort of a steep cup here. But uh, uh, on a weekly chart, things looking a little more positive here with the tight weekly closes. Let's see how we finish out the day. But like I say, this confirmed uptrend uh, <clears throat> in its early stages <clears throat> hit with a distribution day yesterday, and that does not bode well for the rally. It's best to uh, kind of go to the sidelines and wait this out and see if we can regain some strength. So thanks for listening, and good luck.